October 5, 1937, FDR gave a speech to a huge crowd in Chicago. In the same time, Japan started a war against China. Planes swirled in the skies, and Japan bombed China's major cities. In Beijing, 300,000 people and pioneers of war were killed. J Japanese troops defeated China's army and occupied central China. This act alarmed American leaders. By this time, the U.S. had control of the Philippines, which was threatened by the act, Germany taking over countries in Europe, shocking Britain and France. But they didn't take action until later. After Germany defeated France, Japan took control of France and signed the allegiance of Germany and Italy. It was a lovely Sunday on December 7, 1941. There were birds chirping and trees waving in the wind. Our fleet was stationed at Pearl Harbor, Hawaii. All was well until hundreds of Japan planes dotted the sky. Great destruction happened in only a few hours. Almost 200 planes were destroyed, and 2,400 people were killed. Why did they do this, you ask? Well, the United States controlled over the Pacific Ocean, and we cut off their oil supplies. For example, if they had a warm chocolate chip cookie steaming, and someone came over, slapped you, and took your cookie and ran away, you would be angry, right? That is how Japan fleet after the United States cut off their oil resources. In conclusion, we declared war against Japan, and therefore Germany and Italy declared war on the United States again. Little did they know that we were one of the strongest countries in the world.